Ever pondered over the differences between a synagogue, a Christian church, a mosque, a Buddhist monastery, and a Satanist church? It's a fascinating topic, isn't it? Each of these temples, steeped in history and tradition, serve as sanctuaries for believers, yet their structures, rituals, and purposes vary greatly. These differences, in part, define the diverse tapestry of human faith. Join us today as we delve into the distinct aspects of these religious structures, starting with the synagogue, an integral part of Jewish culture. Synagogues are the heart of Jewish life, serving not just as places for worship, but also as centers for community, learning, and social activities. The basic features of a synagogue include the Ark, which houses the Torah scrolls, and the Bima, a platform where the Torah is read. Synagogues can be found around the world, but they hold a significant presence in cities like New York and Jerusalem, where large Jewish communities thrive. Now, if we were to talk about the global Jewish population, it's estimated to be around 15 million. So, what's the purpose of a synagogue? It's a place where Jews come together to pray, study, celebrate, and support each other. It's a physical embodiment of faith, community, and continuity. The synagogue, more than a place of worship, is a community center echoing Jewish traditions. Moving on to the Christian church, a symbol of faith for billions, this spiritual haven is more than just a place of worship. It's a community center where believers gather to share their faith, to learn, to give and receive support. The Christian church is a place where the teachings of Jesus Christ are shared and celebrated through sermons, music, and sacraments such as baptism and communion. Christian churches are scattered across the globe, but they are most prevalent in cities like Rome, Vatican City, and in countries like the United States, Brazil, and Mexico. An approximation of the Christian population worldwide is around 2 billion, making Christianity one of the world's largest religions. From the humble parish church in a small town to the grandeur of St. Peter's Basilica, each Christian church serves the same purpose, to bring its followers closer to God, to provide a place of worship and fellowship, and to serve the community. The Christian church stands as a beacon of hope and faith for its followers. Next in line is the mosque, a cornerstone of Islamic faith. A mosque is not just a place for prayer, but a community hub, a school, a place for celebration, and a refuge. Its architecture often features a dome and minarets from which the call to prayer, the Adhan, is announced. Inside, you'll find an open prayer hall and a mihrab, an indentation in the wall indicating the direction of the Kaaba in Mecca, towards which Muslims pray. Cities like Istanbul, Cairo, and Kuala Lumpur are renowned for their breathtaking mosques. The Islamic faith is widespread, with an estimated 1.5 billion adherents globally. Each believer, no matter their location, finds solace, guidance, and a sense of belonging within the walls of their local mosque. A mosque is more than a building. It's a symbol of unity and collective identity for Muslims around the world. The mosque, a tranquil sanctuary for Muslims, fostering a sense of unity. Lastly, we explore the Buddhist monastery and the Satanist church. The Buddhist monastery, a place of tranquility and meditation, is a cornerstone of Buddhism. It's where monks and nuns lead lives devoted to the pursuit of enlightenment, practicing meditation and adhering to a strict moral code. These monasteries are often found nestled in the heart of nature in places like Tibet and Thailand, where Buddhism has a significant following. Globally, Buddhism is embraced by over 500 million individuals. Moving to the Satanist church, we find a stark contrast. Satanism, often misunderstood, is less about the worship of a literal Satan and more about individualism and self-empowerment. The Church of Satan, for instance, uses Satan as a symbol of pride, liberty, and individualism. These churches can be found scattered across the globe but are most popular in Western countries, with the United States housing a notable number of adherents. Satanism, as a recognized religion, is considerably smaller than Buddhism, with estimates placing the global population at around 100,000. It's important to note that these numbers may not be entirely accurate as many Satanists prefer to practice privately due to societal misconceptions. Whether it's the peaceful Buddhist monastery or the misunderstood Satanist church, each holds a unique place in the world of faith. 